What's up, you guys? What's up? It is still the rain vibe. Oh, my God. How could you forget? How could you not think I was not coming back <laughs> with another tarot reading in the core? <laughs> okay, come on with the seven of wands. Okay, no obstacles shall stop me. No weapon form to give me shall prosper. Now, why am I so excited? Because I have always been excited as a child. And who says that should change as I get older? Because the cares of the world do not care for me. So they do not bother me. And period so why do my eyes look real like i'm tired i'm not tired i had a lot of sleep but who's to say i can't go and get a couple more hours because i just went shopping <laughs> all right you guys i'm so excited for you guys as well i'm excited to get into the messages for what you guys will be overcoming during this winter period period too okay because who is not busting their tails during the winter where most people are just stuck in the house being lazy and, you know, there's nothing wrong with doing that, but there is a lot doing that when you actually have major goals to reach. You want to live in a mansion. You want to be on the front stage, front and center, okay? You guys want to be a model. You want to be the top uh, it could be a voice actor, a speaker, whatever it is. So you guys are already knowing that you have to do things that a lot of people around you would not. Okay? So, yeah, definitely practice standing out and going for what you want to. And it's funny I said standing out because guess the first card we have is the Nine of Wands. Okay? Realizing your obstacles, acknowledging them, but using them this is where the alchemy comes in my alchemist using your obstacles to push forward and see exactly how can you reach your destination possibly even quicker even sooner than expected and i feel like a lot of you guys do not see what is coming because there's like so many things that may seem clouding your judgment clouding your path but really things are just as you envision them before these obstacles appeared in your actual reality okay meaning your mindset was focused on something positive i'm going to get this house i'm going to get this relationship i'm going to get this high paying job i'm going to get that promotion i'm going to be self-sufficient whatever the cause may be or you simply just want to have a better relationship with God and yourself or your kids and family like I said whatever circumstances that recently came up now recently okay talking to some people whatever situation that has seemed to disturb that vision of yours do know it is only being presented in your life to help you overcome that obstacle okay and just in an unexpected way like we wouldn't we wouldn't expect like a flat tire or something down the road to actually help us stop and look not only at the flat tire but to suddenly meet like our future spouse like you know like or someone come and help you and you find out that they want to be or do the same endeavor as you. You'll be surprised how the universe works in your favor just because who you are warrior king queen okay don't play with you. <laughs> I am funny. But I am the truth. So, we got another card here. Hold on. Let me shuffle that. It was too many. You guys, you guys. Next card we have. Okay, we have two cards. We have the Ace of Cups. Okay, Wish Fulfillments and Prosperity. Okay. And we have the Seven of Wands. Okay, another card of Wands. And it's funny because I felt like I felt like the Seven of Wands was going to come out. You know, Seven of Wands could deal with um to me, Seven of Wands just deals with introspection through obstacles as well. So when we are dealing with things dealing with just life in general and we can't see a way out or we feel like we're we're caught up in some things in the past whether we're in conflict with ourselves on how we're going to act okay on this decision we don't know how to move forward we don't know how to put this thought into action well the ace of cups is coming out to tell you that whatever your heart desires it is true that is the truth and the truth always has to be true meaning it always has to manifest so whatever you are desiring it is within you and just because you cannot physically see it does not mean it's there but the universe has to work for you okay because you are in alignment and whatever has happened in your past does not have any effect on your 
present, and especially your future, my love. So understand that. Understand that you are taller. You are much huger than any obstacle that stands in your way, even people, okay, circumstances, even the weather itself, okay? You are worth what you are going to receive, which is going to be like so much abundance, okay? That's why I'm also getting getting from the Seven of Wands. So many opportunities, people coming in trying to help people trying to come in to like help you okay help you become stable help you become just secure within yourself it could be just a um an encouragement of words motivational uh speech but you guys are going to be like what's the word not bamboozled <laughs> well you may feel bamboozled because some of these things that people will be telling you you probably wouldn't have believed for yourself but you guys are going to be like piled up with so much motivation and just passion that you're going to understand what it really feels like to be free okay freedom and expression freedom emotionally and just with that knowing that awareness itself that's why you guys will be able to move in freedom okay i was just talking about the stages and the cycle of remanifesting your life based on freedom in my recent youtube video you guys go check that out all right Okay, so we also I also saw the three of wands, which deals with expansion, okay, new perspectives and reaching milestones, okay? So you guys, like I said, your manifestation is coming in very swiftly. Keep act on it. You have to act on it. A lot of you guys, here's the message. If you guys act, you know what you can do. You thought, you thought, you thought some more, and you been trying to find like the answer on how to get out of this situation but something just came to your mind if it was not recently now something that you know you can do to help you get to your goals okay do not think about how it will be but just know what you want it to be okay your mind is the perspective your mind is the all-knowing all-seeing and you have to see okay progress at all times all right look at this the higher friend. You have to take authority over your life. You have to take authority of your life and know that you are secure wherever you are, okay? Because no one or nothing can judge you. No one or nothing can put you down. You are the authority figure in your own life. It is good to go out there and see other people for advice, but you have to know that you are the one who makes the decision at the end of the day because these people cannot be with you for the rest of your life. Your family cannot be with you all of your life to help you make decisions. It is good to have them around but you have to know how to be in your own abundance, my love. Okay, with the Ace of Cups at the bottom, still the Hierophant. You have to know that you are in authority of your own life, okay? And you also have the up, the one up in every situation, okay? If your connection with the universe is very strong, okay? You are very, you're much guided, okay? Through this period in your life, okay? You guys are definitely going to be overcoming some sense of insecurities, Okay, fear of failure because you're going to be seeing exactly, realizing exactly all that you can do by yourself. The emperor. You, what did I just say about authority figure? You are in control. You are already stable. Your mindset is stable. Stop overthinking about, oh, if I'm ready, am I ready? You are ready, my love. Okay, finances. Yes, I know it can be a little hard when it comes to handling them don't we all okay but at the same time you have to know that you have always been able to make more than what you have okay you are able to create things that produce abundance in just the flick of a wrist whether it's drawing painting writing uh you know like it could be anything playing video games some of you may be content creators may well be a video game programmer or you know just streaming like you guys are very creative okay you're very skilled and talented do know that you have what it takes to have a place in this world if you feel like you don't belong in here think again because those thoughts were not yours let's get one couple one last message all right i'm gonna get out of here all right mm, two of cups Falling back in love with yourself, knowing that you are deserving of the same love that you give out to others. So if someone is not operating on the same level as you, it's okay. Continue moving in love, but do know that 
you are always deserving of the same that you put out. So don't allow anyone or any circumstance to make you feel like you are deserving of less. There are so many people in this world that do not know themselves and they did not know how to receive love or better yet, give it. So just because someone else refuses to grow on their own spiritual journey does not mean you have to be the one to teach them and guide them. You are going through your own challenges and awakening life. You are going to be elevated regardless, my love. So if someone doesn't want to abide by the highest force in the world which is love they do not deserve to come with you and you do not deserve to keep pouring your all into these people or this person or situation period i love you and have a nice day it's the rain vibe Mwah.